What does the Bible say about cheating? Discover the top Bible verses about cheating from the Old and New Testaments. Read through the biblical references of cheating to learn more about its meaning and significance. May you find some insight from these related scripture quotes, saying, When will the new moon be over that we may sell grain, and the Sabbath be ended that we may market wheat? Skipping on the measure, boosting the price, and cheating with dishonest scales. You shall not commit adultery. Marriage should be honored by all, and the marriage bed kept pure, for God will judge the adulterer and all the sexually immoral. No temptation has overtaken you except what is common to mankind, and God is faithful. He will not let you be tempted beyond what you can bear. But when you are tempted, He will also provide a way out so that you can endure it. The Lord detests lying lips, but He delights in people who are trustworthy. You have heard that it was said, You shall not commit adultery. But I tell you that anyone who looks at a woman lustfully has already committed adultery with her in his heart. All Scripture is God-breathed and is useful for teaching, rebuking, correcting, and training in righteousness. You shall not covet your neighbor's house. You shall not covet your neighbor's wife, or his male or female servant, his ox or donkey, or anything that belongs to your neighbor. For since the creation of the world God's invisible qualities, His eternal power and divine nature, have been clearly seen, being understood from what has been made, so that people are without excuse. If a man is found sleeping with another man's wife, both the man who slept with her and the woman must die. You must purge the evil from Israel. I made a covenant with my eyes not to look lustfully at a young